Hi guys, uh, me again. Thought I should show you a small um, thing I, I want to talk about about sketching in Fusion 360. Uh, sometimes you are sketching like here. Apparently, this should have given me the go sign that it's closed, etc. Mm, so let's go into edit mode, and you can see there are several lines. That's fine. But even though like like all these extra see here I, I made sketch line li like from this point to that point but it still doesn't go complete like a closed loop and the reason for this is that imagine you are uh, you're sketching uh, let me see I can try and do the camera you're sketching and it seems like everything is on a 2d plane but what happens is that in reality uh, where you have these these points here like here there are layers upon layers of sketch points and you can see this if you left click uh, if you left click on it and you can see that you have several sketch points here in the overview and and in this case you can see that I have this point, this is the actual one I used when I drew that specific line. And then you have this point, that is the one that is related to the arch. And then you have this point, is related to the line that is dotted. And then you can see there are several lines here that look like they are going together. But uh, in other cases, you may not have a dotted one. Uh, like a dot at all and if you left click on this you can still see that there are two sketch points so how do you solve this because what you want to do is you want to hit exactly the sketch point that go to the arch if you want to close the loop and what you can do I'm not sure if it works right here but that is let's see this one would close the arch because you see that it goes through everything arch line 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 this is the dotted line and then you see sketch point and then you see it completes so i can tell by this that i actually managed to interact with the correct sketch point when i made this line going to this arch but on the other side here if I do the same there, then you have sketch point, sketch point, and then you have the arch, near line, line, and line, and arch. And you can see there is actually no connection. So what you need to do is you need to delete the sketch points that are not relevant. So in I'll, I'll go in and I'll just delete that sketch that that line. And then I'll select all these other sketch. That's the one I need. I need to keep that because I'm gonna interact with the thingy and then I go there and I mark it you mark it by left hold left click and uh, you, you have to sort of hold your left click for like a second and then you get the menu and then you select a point that is not relevant in this case it's sketch point and then you press delete and you can see you don't see a sketch point here anymore but it's still there but it's it's like hidden so what happens is you go in and you say, okay, I want to select from here and you find the sketch point, like in this case, this one, and let me see, press control. And then place first point. And if you're lucky now, it should actually connect to the other one. Now, how do you know that it, that it connects to the circle? If you if you do like that, and then you go here, you see that you get this circle sign, which means that the loop will be closed. See? Now, with just one point, I actually managed to close the loop. Because I went in and I deleted the non-relevant sketch points. That was here. And that is how you can 
verify if you're actually on the same layer as the sketch point that you need to model after. Sometimes it can be tricky to find the correct one, but you can always go in and, and check it. So I hope that all helps, and see you in the next one.